to meet Isaiah. And now you're going to hear from Isaiah. He has a little message for all of you guys. So here's Isaiah. What up, y'all? Uh, I just want to say thank you for everyone for coming out. It was great to see y'all. Um, excited for this little playoff run we're about to have. And I hope... I hope you're all there supporting because at the end of the day, um, y'all make it so much easier to go out and play hard every day. So, um, first of all, I just appreciate y'all's support. And um, let's get this little playoff run going. about playoffs how are you guys feeling with playoffs about to be coming up uh we're feeling real good i mean um just having now og back i think it's gonna be big for us him being healthy um i think just building up to the playoffs i think we've been playing a lot better as a team together i think moving the ball and um just making easy easy reads and so i think especially when the playoff comes um that ISO ball is kind of a little, little bit harder to play. So I think now just having multiple guys that can move off the ball. You have Dante, um, Josh can give you a triple double every night. Um, OG to me is the best defender in the league. And then, um, you know, Jalen's going to be Jalen. So so we're excited. Um, and we just got to keep taking it day by day. And um, yeah, we're excited though. Okay. All right, Isaiah, that's the team. I want to know about you. What is the biggest thing that you were working on heading into this season? No, but just coming in, just wanted to just be more versatile. And I think, um, especially going to the playoffs, uh, a lot of teams that have been so focused on Jalen, uh, trapping him. So I think we've done a good job of just being prepared for that. Um, I think you have seen the last couple games, um, Jalen's playmaking. And so I think that's going to be big for us in the playoffs. I have to ask you about your blocks, okay? How does it feel to block someone? It feels good. I mean, the only thing that's that's bad about Jalen, he plays no defense. So I'm normally in a chance to be getting dumped on most of the time, but I'll put my body on the line every time. So um, Jalen makes it up on offense, so we do it on that. <laughs> All right, and for you, you have experience winning in the postseason. What do you feel like you bring to this next squad heading into the postseason? Uh, I mean, just versatility. I mean, thinking being what we just talked about before, Jay, there's going to be a lot of pressure on Jalen. So giving him an option that can pass very well. So um, just being versatile, doing whatever the team needs, hustling, putting my body on the line. I think that's the biggest thing. And um, no, I'm excited, I think. Last year, the playoffs in the Garden was special. I mean, we ran out for warm-ups, and there was, like, goosebumps. I mean, I don't think I've ever felt the energy like that. So um, we're excited for that. And um, a lot of what we do um, couldn't be done without the fans, because to me, we have the best fans in the league, and it's on a consistent basis. So. That's a sign. All right, I'm going to let Isaiah have the last word. Before we go, I want me send everybody home. No, again, appreciate everyone coming out. Appreciate the support. Um, we couldn't do it without y'all. Um, excited for playoffs. Hope y'all excited for playoffs and hope y'all bring the energy. So, appreciate it. Appreciate it. You like, you like that Nixon 4? Yeah, I love, I love Nixon 4. Isaiah, thank you so much for being here. Appreciate it. Oh, appreciate y'all having me. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it.